What's going on YouTube? Back out here in the greenhouse yet again. Another update of these peppers. And they're starting to thin out a little bit. Where it used to be all big and bushy right there. Now it's starting to thin out. But as you can see, still got pods everywhere all over this like this guy. Oh, that was that branch I broke. Um, yep, still a little sick. Oh, look, dropping pods too. That one was almost right, poor little feller. Um, but we still got a pile. Dang it, look, there's a ripe one way out there too. Uh, still got a pile of pods, rain like crazy, all my cups are full in there, so it means the bins are actually pretty daggone full too. We got some more out here, but I mean we're still producing tons of pods all over here. There's a bunch over here, a pile of them down here, look at that man, there's more pods on that than there is uh, leaves. Um, what else we got, Kangstar White Tie over here, Ugh, starting to look pretty horrible up here actually, um, and kind of wilty. That's probably because these containers are way too filled with water. There's a few pods starting to pop off right there. More over here. Beautiful. Do we have any that are starting to turn purple? Because that's what they like to do. Nope. I don't see any. I think that might have been sun scalding. But, oh, my clip here doesn't really seem to be working much. That was holding it all the way over. Look, we got some uh, ahi pineapple. Did I say that? These are pineapples. Um, pineapples. Growing right through the Kang Star White Tie. Let's see what else we have over here. We got some. Oh my gosh, are these almost ripe? These are pretty much ripe. I'm gonna have to go ahead and start picking as soon as I'm done making this video. Look, there's another one practically ripe. Crazy. It doesn't look ripe on the camera, but it does in real life. Look, got more over here. Those are all pineapples. More pineapples over here. More Kang Star White Tie. Look at all these guys sticking up. Looking great, really starting to bush up pretty good. Look, there's a pile of them down here, starting to pot off, uh, put off, yeah. Some more over there. Look, something looks like it ate my plant over here. Let's see, oh, there's some more pineapples down there. Hey, quick grab my thingy plant. Um, what else do we have? Well, that's a sugar rush, you can tell just by the way it looks. Um, oh yeah, it's the same plant with these ones. Oh, more sugar rush over here. Hey, it's a lot easier to see the pods now, right? Um, what else do we got here? Here's some more pineapples. Look at that. Look at this whole thing. Jeez, oh man, look at all the pods on there. All the way up over here. Man, that's a lot of pods for one branch. Ooh, white fatale. If you can see that, it's like pink. That's what I was talking about. They've been turning pink this year instead of white. More, uh, that's that one with the inverted thingy. Still waiting on that guy to actually uh, get ripe. Way in the back here, these yellow ones. Way back here. Oh, wow, there's more back here. All right. These are all lemon drops. Looking pretty decent. Man, I'm going to have a pile of pods to uh, pick tonight. Oh, man, look at this. These guys finally ripened up over here, too. Look at that. Mangoes. All looking good. Ooh, that one's not looking good over there. The branch and the camera. And pick this thing all at the same time. Look at that. Ooh, gross. Alright, we don't need that one. Um, over here, got a pile more. Just hanging out out there. Here's some more. Dang, I didn't even see these guys right here. Some more right here. Another, wow, there's more over here. Jeez, oh man. When you don't check your plants for a little while, you tend to have a lot of pods ready. Um, what else? More sugar rush. Look, these ones, totally, they're almost like yellow. Like a like a dull yellow when they first pop off and that's how they remain for a long time but eventually well besides this crap on the bottom here uh, well here let me just take this with me um besides this crap at the bottom they'll actually turn like a peach color um what else do we got oh right down here hey look i still don't have shoes on um more sugar rushes right there some more mangoes oh look at that one i got split open weird so did this one ah that's just a leaf sticking to it. Uh, more mangoes over here. Let me see. I'll set this here. I'll come back for that, I swear. Um, more mangoes over here. These guys thinned out like crazy. Look at this. this not even joking, this plant has more uh, pods on it than leaves. Look, there's one leaf right there. Three pods. We got one leaf over here and one pod. So it's got more... That's not you, right? No. Oh, wait. We got another branch over here. Hey. <laughs> No, oh no, there's one leaf right there, and one pod, another pod over here. So we have like three leaves on this entire plant, and I've got more pods than I do leaves. Weird. Here's a pile of mangoes over there, all hanging out. Man, this camera does not want to focus. Hey, what else is new, right? 
here's some more right over here thought I was stepping on a pod here's some more mangoes this is just the ahi mango section if you're wondering why there's so many more over here halfway right uh ooh, thought I lost that one. Ooh, dang look at that one that one's really ripe that's looking nice um a couple of these plants are not looking bad look this one's got leaves sweet oh, you didn't see that one that fell uh, more mangoes more mangoes over here uh, just pile of mangoes all over the place. Look at that. All over there. All over there. Not bad for... What the heck are we? Like, middle of December now. Some more over there. So, or we're beyond middle of December. We're like two-thirds of the way through. Alright. Okay, that's this. And, alright. Uh, was there any other ones in here? No. I don't think so, but that white Fatale, I really didn't get many pods off that guy this year. I think I only got like five or six. There we go. Look at that. There's some of that purpling I was talking about on the Kang Star white tie. I like the way it does that. I don't I don't know if that makes a difference to the taste or anything like that, but I feel like it makes it taste better. And once again, some more pineapples over here. Looking all good. It's so cool how you can actually see them now. Whereas be all summer I'd have to like dig through all the leaves and stuff holy cow what the heck happened to this garden i don't know we'll talk about that later now over to the ahi lemon drop section and lemon drop ahi lemon whatever you want to call them um and these guys some of them are small some of them are half decent size but uh ooh, look at that guy that one's not bad right there that's the kind i want to save seeds from the longer ones these little tiny little guys not so much but they're going to be good for making some powders or something. I think that's all I'm going to be doing is powders. Look at that pile of them. These guys took forever to start popping off. But when they did, they started ripening up real quick. Look at that. Beautiful, man. What a beautiful sight. Usually, I'd come out and pick like two, three out of this whole section right here. And right now, it looks like I got, I don't know, 20 or so to pick all at one time. So, that's cool. And some of these guys still have leaves on them. So, that's pretty awesome. Um... Here's some more over here, lemon drops. Look at this, they're not even changing colors yet. They still got a lot of leaves. Look at all these leaves. All right, way to go, little guy. That little guy right there. What else do we got? Just tons of uh, half-decent ones. One about to ripen there. I thought I saw a pile of them. Eh, here's a couple hanging out outside. Oh, here's a pile up here. Hey, <laughs> uh, I think that's about it. Oh, there's another guy here. I don't know what the heck happened to this guy. I think it's been on there a little too long. It's a little squishy, and it uh, doesn't look so hot. So we will take that, toss it into my dirt garden, and we'll see what pops up next year. Oh, there we go. There's a pile of those pods all over the place there. Um, here we go, yellow naga brain. Not very wrinkly or bumpy or anything, but still holding its own. Uh, here's some naga brains here looking half decent. Another little guy. Oh, it's coming with me. Um, and here's another little guy right here. Looking good. Here's one right here. Not even ripe. Oh, okay. Maybe that one doesn't want to be ripe. Alrighty. Um, just pop these in my pocket. Like, that's where they're supposed to go. Down here, got uh, Kiero Cream. That one's tiny. I don't know why that thing's so tiny. Another little tiny one here. They've actually been a lot bigger than that. But, as you can see, as you can see, there's almost no leaves on this entire plant. So... Eh, that's what happens. Speaking of no leaves on a plant, look at this. Boot Orange Copenhagen, that one, and this one. No leaves on a Dagon plant, either one of them. But look at all the pods on there. How amazing is that? No leaves, yet it still has pods. Well, I guess the leaves just fell off. Here's a ripe one right down here. Almost ripe anyway. I'm going to pick it anyway. Um, another Kyoto Cream. I guess Kyoto Cream are pretty much done. They must be like a more of a warm weather plant. And over here to my favorite pepper of the year, if I had to pick one, and that would be my, well, it's starting to drop leaves and stuff. You dropping? Yeah. Uh, look at all the leaves down there. Those are all from the pepper. Um, but we still got a ton of pods on here, and this is my Ahi Hobito. Looking good. Look, there's some ripe ones right there. Looking good. Hey, why is there that one way down there? That's not cool. Um, there's another one over there. The wind's been pretty bad lately, and obviously the rain freaking horrible so that's why i haven't been doing updates because when i had a day off it was raining and i don't have an umbrella for some reason here's a nice ripe one that's about decent size that's what they normally are about approximately and over here the last two plants 
Look at that. Look at all the leaves. Look at all the pods, man. This sucker's doing great. Still, look at that. Bunches of pods. Every little cluster. Look at that. Bunch of ripe ones. But there's a bunch in here. Okay, there's three. A uh, couple down here. Oh, that's a ripe one. There's the unripe one. And that guy. And there we go. Oh, that's a nice ripe one there. That's like orange color almost. So, that's what we got still growing on here. And like I said, it's coming towards the end of December. My goal every year is to get these plants to actually make it until into January. I'm not very picky about that. It could be January 1st for all I care. It could be January 21st. That would be great too. But uh, judging on the way some of these guys are looking, I don't know. It might be better if we just went ahead and had a frost and just killed these guys off. But when I see plants like this lemon drop over here, it makes me think, hey, what the heck, man? We might have a little bit of time still, uh, you know, in the season. Let's see how many more pods we can get. So, And anyway, like I said, I'm happy that they're still growing. So last year they all died in late November or the first week of December or something like that. So we already have an increase of uh, productivity over last year, a little bit. Um, uh, as far as these other gardens, I don't know. There's a lot of stuff going on with those. Maybe I'll do an update about those guys here shortly. But anyway, thanks for hanging out with me. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. Um, make sure you come back. Check us out on Mondays and Fridays for the live streams. And I'll tell you about when all my other friends have live streams too. So you can check that out because we almost have the entire week booked with live streams now. Um, also, don't forget the Mystery Amazon link is down below. What's on it? I don't know, but you'll find out if you click on it. I appreciate that. I get, um, I get credit for driving them traffic, and they give me some kind of kickback sometime. I don't know. We'll find that out in the future. Um, and I think that's about it. There's Patreon down there somewhere. For some reason, you wanted to do that. Not, a, uh, not necessary, though. But anyway, that was it for this update. Thanks for hanging out with me. Do all that fun, happy... Oh, yeah, do the comment thing down below. Man, it's been so long since I made a video. Do the comment thing down below. Leave a comment. Not just for me. I love the comments. But for everybody else, so they can see you are here, so they can find your channel and subscribe up, because I ask everybody to hop in the comment section, check out everybody that you don't know, and subscribe up to them if you like their channel. And, uh, yeah, do all that fun, happy social media stuff down below. I will catch y'all in the next video. So, till then. Later.